Right, so um, obviously apart from the clay granules that have come this week, uh, we've been painting manically. We've painted pretty much every room now um, with lime. I'll show you how we do that. But we're also quite excited because these three bags arrived yesterday and they are pigments in primary colours. Iron oxide. Amarello, that's yellow. Malaga, I think that must be the red. And this one looks like it could be blue. <coughs> and uh, we've also been using some clay granules as well. This one's a like a very rich dark one that we've been we put in the kitchen. This is a lighter one that we put in this spare bedroom. It's probably gonna be mum's Bonnie's mum's bedroom one day. Um anyway, I just thought you might be interested to see how what paint we've been using. Now this is a kind of big dustbin full of slate lime. Now probably about 18 months ago we um, we started slaking the lime and that's uh, white lime. You put it in it creates a really strong reaction. I think I'll put a link on the web you can see when we first made it. But we had two big barrels of these, two big bins, and it just sits. I don't know if you can see that, but the white stuff's below the water. Then <coughs> You mix it, depending on what kind of consistency you want, with about uh, three, four, five parts water to one part lime putty. And then you put this little baby in and turn it on. It always separates. Um, and then you use one of those and mix it up into whatever quantities you like. So we're going to now begin to start experimenting with the colours that we want for each room. But we've already used the clay granules, these ones, to produce this kind of colour. Very, very soft. It needs probably just one more coat. But this has had four coats this week. Uh, very fine. I'll show you some of the other colours. Uh, this one's white. <laughs> well interesting. Uh, I don't know what colour we're actually going to be putting in there. The kids' room have all got white as well. They've all got their two or three coats of white. Um, library's got white. But I'll show you the colour in the kitchen. Every spare bit of space. I'll come out and show you that in a sec. It's a pink colour. Vonnie's mixed it up special to create this pinky colour. And this had about, again, four or five layers, a couple of layers of white. And then with a darker layer. So it was actually dark and she's been going over it with, with more of a, a dry brushing with some of the white paint. To make the new plaster look old, really. And just to do it up in layers. So uh, we really like it. Love it. And that wall over there is going to have tiles on it. So mucking around with paints. Um, and the colours are going to go on this weekend. Me and Josh are going to go and play cricket this weekend. So Vonnie and Eloise are going to do all the painting and playing around with colours. But it's not just housework that we do here. Um, it's gardening as well, obviously. And Vonnie's been frantic the last couple of months, as you know, about the trees. And she's going to do her own blog post on the trees because she, she loves trees. And she's going to show them all now they're all growing. But the other thing she'll be doing is just planting. Planting, planting. Looks like a nursery in here. Bulbs and... We'll have a look using the scaffolding <laughs> as uh, platforms so we can get more shelves of plants in. But this is a really good idea. I learned this off Sarah Raven. Thanks, Sarah Raven. Uh, just old, gu just guttering um, in one metre strips. Fill it with soil. Then plant in your peas or whatever else you're, you're planting in. Then when you're ready to plant out into the beds, just take two people, push the soil out, and they're straight in. Genius. But got these little propagators too. Self-watering. It's a high of activity here. Fantastic. Fantastic. This will be the utility room. This is my first ceiling plastered. Did a lot of rendering in here. And Joao showed me how to do it. Our neighbour. And uh, did it with him. But yeah, it's well happy with the result. Plastering on the ceiling. I tell you. It's not as easy as plaster on a wall, because most of it goes on your head. Um, so there we go, colours, paint, painting with lime, they call it here Calviva. 
And this one's going to go yellow, I think. Bonnie's even going to be in here painting it yellow. New treatment room. Why are you painting it yellow, babe? It's sunny. It's white at the moment, but it's going to go yellow. Too clinical. What would you like to call it? Primrose. <laughs> Alright, sweet. Uh, right, let's get painting then. Bye. <laughs> Bonnie loves cameras. <laughs> Bye. Bye.